Today, I'm going to give you a step-by-step -step guide to the fastest path to affiliate on Twitch. Wow. So you can start earning money from your streams as fast as possible. And I promise you, if you do all these things, you will get affiliate. It's just proven. It's science. It's just math. I mean, it took me longer, but that's because no one had made me this video. But I don't want that to happen to you. I'm Lavanda Rocks, and I stream DJ sets and just chatting over on Twitch. As you know, Twitch Affiliate is a program that allows you to monetize your stream through bits and subscriptions. And anyone can become an affiliate as long as you meet certain criteria. So to be a Twitch affiliate, you need to have at least 50 followers, stream for at least 8 hours in the last 30 days, streamed on 7 different days in the last 30 days, and have an average of 3 concurrent viewers. So let's get into the step-by-step -step guide to being an affiliate. Step number one is all about making connections before you even start streaming. The most difficult part of becoming an affiliate, in my opinion, is having the 3 concurrent viewers. The fastest way to affiliate is to already have a network of people who will come and support you. My suggestion as always is to show up in streams that you really like and make connections maybe even join the streamers discord but when it's time for you to launch your channel you have a place to promote it and talk about it but since we're talking about the fastest way to affiliate here's the cheat code to get those three concurrent viewers you can make a few other twitch accounts and sign into those when you go live on your main channel ask a loved one your bff the people that you know show up to the stream and just leave the tab open boom three concurrent viewers in the long run though you'll want real viewers so here's your action step join three to four discords of your favorite streamers if you haven't already and set yourself a reminder to engage actually go in and look at what's going on in the discord when it's time for you to start streaming post in their promo channel if they have one you're welcome to join my discord where we have a space for people who are trying to get affiliate i'll link it in the description the next step is to set a schedule and stick to it. Consistency is the key on Twitch. Make sure that you're streaming at regular times that work for you that you can commit to. When you stream at regular times, your viewers know when to expect you. Back in the day, we used to have TV shows that we'd have to wait for. I would wait all week for The Love Boat and Fantasy Island. It's the same principle. Ninja, one of the biggest streamers, stresses the importance of consistency in your streaming schedule to build a loyal audience and to fast track becoming a Twitch affiliate. But don't overdo it. Don't plan to stream seven days a week for 12 hours a day. Be realistic and remember that most of the growth on Twitch happens off your stream. In fact, if you're streaming over three hours and there are less than three people there, you're wasting your time because you need the concurrent viewers. So trust me, just stream for a couple of hours and stop. Your action step is to use Twitch's schedule feature to let your viewers know when you'll be streaming next. Update it and make sure that you can commit to it for at least the next 30 days. The next step is to promote your channel on other social media platforms. Let people know when you're streaming and what you're streaming. Promoting your channel on other social media platforms is essential because you can't get discovered on Twitch when you're just starting out. In my experience, TikTok has been the best way to engage with other streamers and bring awareness to my Twitch. I made a video about what to post as a streamer and I'll link it up here and in the description. It's more than just posting, here's my stream setup, come watch me. Collab posts are really getting pushed right now on Instagram, so collaborating with other streamers and posting joint content is a really good way to get discovered. And if you already have an existing following on another platform, leverage that and bring them over to Twitch. Your action step is to make sure all of your socials link back to Twitch. You want to make it really easy for someone if they're checking you out just to be able to go to your Twitch channel. If your main goal is to grow on Twitch, don't put a link tree. Actually put the link back to your Twitch. The next step is to stream something that isn't super saturated. This means you might have to wait to stream your favorite games and categories. But remember, your goal here is to get affiliate fast. Once you do that, you can do whatever you want. A great way to find out games that have a lot of viewers and a relatively low amount of streamers is using Twitch Strike. Your action step is to go to twitchstrike.com Click on best, type in how many average viewers you have, and then you'll get a list of games that work best for you. Now, if you're finding this helpful, please give me a like, hit that subscribe button. If you want to know about all things Twitch and you want to keep growing, but only if you like to have fun while you learn. The next step is about engaging with the viewers that are there. Engaging with the audience is key to growing a loyal following. Make your viewers feel welcome and appreciated by chatting with them and being very timely about saying hello when someone comes to your chat. Streaming while chatting is a skill and it takes a little bit of time to get used to, but like all skills, 
Anything can be learned. If you're not sure what to say, ask people questions. Get to know them. Show them appreciation by giving shout outs and thank them for being there. Usually you're gonna start with zero viewers, so get used to talking to yourself. Only one person in the chat? You better make them feel super special. So your action step, make a list of things to talk about before you start streaming. That way, if you get nervous, you can refer back to your list. If you need help, go to livestreamideas.com and with a press of a button, you can generate hundreds of things to talk about. The next step, this is the most important, stay positive and persistent. Success on Twitch takes time and dedication. It's not going to happen overnight. Focus on the small goals and create quality content. Remember, Twitch is a marathon and not a sprint. Now here's a video you need to watch about the five things the pros do before they stream. I'll see you over there.